guys, welcome back. Hope you're all doing so, so well. Happy New Year to all of you. So I've decided to start the year with a haul and not just any haul, a bikini haul, which I feel like I haven't done in so, so, so long. Out of all the bikini brands I've worked with, I am collaborating once again with Cupshe, which I'm not going to lie, is one of the best bikini brands that I've worked with. Material-wise, fit-wise, most of the bikinis always fit me and are secure and are good. But before we get started, I do have a discount code. It is GINA15 and it gets you 15% off all orders above £49. So if you are going on holiday to get away from the winter or you've booked for summer and you're looking for some bikinis and you want to save some shmoney then use the discount code you know what i'm saying and because it's been a while i am going to remind everyone that i do put everything in the description so in the order that i tried it on in and with the links and with the sizes so do not worry if i don't mention them in the video sometimes i do forget because i'm so excited trying everything on that i'm like oh crap i forgot to mention this and that but it will be in the description so do not worry and without babbling on too much let's just get straight into this haul because i'm so excited i haven't done a haul in a very very long time so let's just do these so the first bikini is this orange bikini, which I absolutely love. It is so, so cute. Makes the watermelons look very, very good. Guys, by the way, the floorboards creaking hasn't changed. So bear with me, it is what it is. Like they're gonna creak once in a while, but I'm sure I am louder than the creaking floorboards. So it should be fine for the video. Back to the bikini. I absolutely love orange on a tan, on holiday. It is such a banging color. And I also really like the shape of the bikini. Like it makes the watermelons look great. I like that this is quite thick. Like it almost looks like a top. So it kind of half sits on your shoulders, half sits like a t-shirt, which is very, very cute. And then the bikini bottoms are full reef bikini bottoms. I've tucked them in, as you know, if you've watched my bikini hauls, I like tucking them in, I can tuck them further, but I'm not gonna do that. I'm gonna show you them as full reefs. They are like this, but obviously I like tan of the bum cheeks. So I do tuck them in like that. You can wear them however you wanna wear them. They are full coverage when it comes to the pom pom section, which I absolutely love. I don't like bikinis, which have like a tiny little triangle at the front and I'm like, bro, that's not enough, like half your pom is on display. That just annoys me so much. This is full coverage, very, very comfortable. The size that I chose for this bikini is extra small. Now I'm not gonna lie to you, let's go to a little negative. The watermelons, they're not secure. If I bend over, both of them are popping out like boop. So that's the only thing I've got to say. It looks really good, but as for a bikini that I'll wear to the beach while I'm swimming, probably not. Maybe one that I would just go to like a beach bar with and try and not bend over in, then I would definitely rock this. And then also the back is just a buckle clasp, which is very convenient. I feel like it is tight enough on my waist. I do have quite small waist compared to my chest and it all feels good for an extra small. So if you do have smaller tetas, then this would be the bikini for you. And let's move on to the next. And just before we move on to the next one, I am gonna show you a close up of what I meant of these little dots. Very, very cute. It's a cute detail for a bikini. Oh my God, the jugs in this look amazing. I actually absolutely love this. As I was putting it on, I was like, these are a bit high, but now that I'm looking at myself, I'm thinking, god dang you. So this bikini is also in an extra small. I do prefer the fit of this bikini and the security that it provides for my water malones. Because it's shaped as a sports bra, it's very unlikely that my boobs will fall out of this. And I also love the high-waisted pants. It goes so, so well. I think the high-waisted pants and the pattern look so, so cute. It is the perfect high-waisted as it does cover the belly button. I don't like high-waisted pants which are like somewhat between, like it's not quite there. This is perfect. And then we do have thick straps which is great for my shoulders. It means that my shoulders are not in pain. I'm not gonna get any deep cuts from the weight of these babies because when it's a thicker strap, it evens out the weight and it doesn't give me marks, which is great. And now I'm gonna show you the back. Obviously, you guys already know, I've done a little tuck tuck, I'm going to show you it in full. I wouldn't say this is actually a full brief, to be honest, and it slides in really easy and doesn't look odd and too scrunched at the back. So this is how I would wear it. And then the back of the top is a couple of strings, which you can tie as tight as you want or as loose as you want. But I do really love this bikini, I think it is more my favourite than the orange one. Eww! The material is fabulous, the hold is amazing, I love the black and white, it's just giving me a life. And let's move on to the neck. So guys, the next one is this beautiful green bikini. Honestly, makes me breasts look amazing. Well, they are amazing, but you know, it just enhances them a little bit more. I absolutely love the gold detail it has here. Adds a little bit more spice to the bikini. I also love this little section, which is like a little twist at the front. Very, very cute. And then the pants also have these little frills on the side. I love little details on bikinis because bikinis can be very boring. So adding little details stops it from being boring and makes the bikini look a little bit more saucy, you know what I'm saying? And I also forgot to 
to mention that all of these bikinis have pads in them, which are removable. They're very, very easy to remove. So it's up to you if you want to keep the pads in or if you don't. It's actually quite chilly in the house because I'm in my corridor and the corridor is long and we only have one heat in here. So I've left the pads in. I don't think it makes that, that much of a difference, but obviously you can remove them, add them, however you see fit. The colour is just giving me life. And another thing that I love about this bikini is that the straps are adjustable. Oh yeah, and they are very thick. It isn't a style of a bra, like bras have straps like this. And then I have adjusted the straps quite high so that they're secure and they're tight and they're firm and they're not going anywhere. And now I'm going to show you the back of the bottoms. I have tucked them in, obviously I feel like I should stop saying that I've tucked them in, but this is them as a full brief. And then the back of this is actually very nice, it's just a little bow so you can tie it as tight or as loose as you want it. I've done it quite tight because the waist is quite small. And yeah, I don't have any faults about this bikini. Very, very nice. Kapshi, you're doing bits. I feel like Kapshi has definitely improved in the way they're making their bikinis, like the styles, the fits are so much better than back in the day when I tried Kapshi's stuff. I always knew they were good, but this haul seems to be going a little too well, which is great. And Kapshi is also known for constantly improving and checking their reviews and changing things and making fits better, making the material better, making the straps more easy and adjustable so that all sorts of sizes can wear them. And their size range is amazing. It starts from XS and it goes all the way to 3XL, which is fabulous. And let's move on to the next. So guys, this next bikini, I haven't worn it how the model wears it because it just doesn't fit the top. So I've put out a little on the boob. It doesn't feel uncomfortable at all. I feel like it does look extra, extra hot. But I am disappointed. I would have preferred a bikini top, which was a little bit thicker so that it could fit properly. But let's just move on from the fact that it doesn't fit properly. But I made it work. You know what I'm saying? I am in love with this magenta pink. It is beautiful. I absolutely love it. I wish I had a bikini that fit me in this colour because I would rock it with a tan so well. Love, love, love. I also love the little detail that it has here. It's like this little brown squared detail. Very, very cute. And one thing I am also loving is the pants. They are the perfect bikini pants. Full coverage and the butt is amazing. This is how I like my bikini pants to be, like resilient, you know what I'm saying? Bum cheeks are able to tan. Obviously they don't slide that far in, they're like this normally, which is still very good because full briefs just aren't my thing. While I've got a good booty, I'm gonna tan it as much as I can. And also the top is like this, it has a clasp, it is actually the perfect fit for my waist. Not really my waist, I mean when it was on my waist and my boobs were falling out, it was a perfect fit. But yeah, it's not on my waist at the moment. And the straps are a perfect thickness as well. But it's so unfortunate that it doesn't fit properly. And I'm definitely going to combine these with like a black bikini top because they are hot. And let's move on to the next. So the next bikini is this floral one, which I absolutely love. I love the print on this. Very, very summer. And I do love the colours as well. Let's go straight into the fit. The top. The tetas look amazing, but they are gonna fall out. I'm not very supportive because there isn't much here. A lot of side boob leakage, as you can see. So not a great fit for the top. It is what it is. The bottoms though fit very, very well. I do love them. Very cute. I was just about to forget to slide these out. They are like this normally but obviously you already know that i prefer it my way you know what i'm saying so the back you can't actually adjust at all there's no clasp it's just like a top but the straps you can which is great but they only give you from there to here to adjust which is more than enough it worked out quite well for me i love the fact that this part is thicker and then it gets thin at the back a very very nice detail to have love that it's adjustable but yeah the top if i bend over Hello, what are the longs? So it's a no for the fit for me, but it is super, super comfortable. It's just not secure enough. So let's move on to the next. I am in love with this bikini. I mean, you can't go on holiday without taking like a bright colored bikini, especially a neon one. On a tan, bellissima. So yeah, I'm absolutely in love with this bikini. I love the colour, I love the shape, I love the little keyhole here. Amazing. I actually thought that my shoulders would hurt because the straps are so thin, but it doesn't sit on just my shoulders because it is a crossover, so the weight goes more to my back than anything. I'm going to come a little bit closer and show you the back. So it's got this little adjustable here, which I pulled tight. And as I've pulled it, I've just tied it in a rough little knot because no one's home to help me with these bikinis. Otherwise it would look cute and it would be in a bow, but yeah, not today. And let's move on to the pants. The pants are really cute, you know what I'm saying? Maximum coverage. I also forgot to say, Kapshi does not give you camel toe. Thank you, Jesus. I hate bikinis with materials where it just slides up in the pum pum. And I just feel like, mm mm. I just don't like it. I don't feel like it looks cute or anything like that. So well done to Kapshi and the material that their bikini bottoms are in, because I hate that. And the wetter your bikini gets, the worse it gets. So this is great. 
And then the bottoms obviously I slid in. I've kept the tags on everything just because I was too excited to just rip them all off. So yeah, these are the bottoms. Cute. These are how they are normally. Feel cute, you know what I'm saying? But I'm trying to tie them on cheek. I do love this bikini. It is a definite win for me. And time to move on to the last bikini, which makes me very sad. I've really enjoyed doing this haul. And there will be more hauls to come, so don't you worry. But let's move on to the next and the last. So last but not least is this very cute lilac and white bikini. Now this is supposed to stay tied, but the pressure is not letting it to stay. I would say if I double knotted it, then it would probably stay tied. Let me try. Um, I absolutely love the lilac, it looks so cute on the white, the pattern is very cute, similar to the black and white one, but this is a lilac and white, which also looks very, very cute. The bosoms are looking fantastic, they definitely don't fall out because of the shape of the bikini, it's very sports bra like. I love the keyhole, it is a very nice detail, gives you a little bit of cleavage here and a little bit of cleavage there, in case you didn't see the cleavage here, and though it wasn't really needed, but it's cute. Uh, the pants are perfect, like pom pom coverage, amazing. And then I'm going to show you the back. The back of the top is very, very similar to the green one that I had on just before this one. I have also pulled it tight again um, and tied a little knot the best way I could, like this, because I've literally been putting on the bikinis as they've been tied, trying to like not get them loose because, yeah, no one's here to help me. I also love that it goes from thick straps into thin straps. Very, very nice. I do love anything cross back, I think it looks extra hot. And now we're going to go to here which is the bottoms very very cute this is how they look normally i have tucked them in because they are full brief it does have a little bit of a crinkle but i don't think it's that deep like in the middle still looks cute you know what i'm saying and that is it for the haul thank you so so much for watching and a great thank you to Cupshi for working with me your bikinis have improved majorly i absolutely loved them a few you know didn't fit top wise but that is what is going to happen when you got big boobs and a small waist it can't be helped not everything is going to be for my body type but overall the material the designs, the colours, absolutely love. So if you do want to shop Cupshe, don't forget to use my discount code, head over to the description and you will find all the links and details in there. But that's it for now, don't forget to comment, like and subscribe and see you in my next video. Bye!